Okay, I'm now at Central Park. By chance, I met these two gentlemen. Uh, we just listened to one of their, was it Colombian music, folk it's music? Traditional Colombian music. Yeah. Okay, so uh, just let me know who are you. Okay. Uh, the song we just played, uh, I learned it from Jesus Maria Saya, which is a flute player. He died like two years ago. He was like 89 years old. How do you spell his name? Jesus, G-E-S-U-S, M-A-R-I-A, Sayas, S-A-Y-A-S. Okay. Yeah, he was from San Onofre, Colombia, and he died two years ago. And this was one of the songs he used to play. And you? <laughs> and you? <laughs> so, well, uh, we're, my name What is kind of... Yeah. Oh, I sorry, I interrupted. What was no, your no, name? No, no. Juan Ospina. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, uh, just just tell me what you wanted to say. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, this, the name of, of, of what we're doing is from, is from Colombia. Yes. Folkloric music from Colombia. And it, these instruments are called gaitas. Um, there is the gaita hembra, which is camilos. This is gaita macho. So this is more the bass, right? Yeah, yeah the bass accompaniment. Right? Ah, so you're the supporting flute, yeah. and he's the soloist. He's carrying yeah, the, the melody. A melody, Usually right. this music is played with drums. Uh, is this two flutes? Ah. Uh, three more drums, and also singing. You're just hearing the part, just practicing. Practicing? Yeah, yeah. Uh, usually it's with three drums plus. Ah, okay. And... Uh, and it's, so it's, the, it's the, the point of, uni of union between when the drums, right? It's, yes. It's the African heritage of oh, okay. Colombia. And then the flutes and the maraca is indigenous heritage. Yes. And um, then the music is sung in, in Spanish, which is sort of like the European influence since we were conquered by the Spanish. So Unfortunately. Or yeah. fortunately. Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Everything is everything. <laughs> and uh, what did you, what did, you bring to New York? What? Um, we're immigrants. <laughs> we live here. So what, you. What do we bring to New York? Yeah, what did. Why did you come? Oh, why did we come? I don't know. I mean, I was, you know, like many immigrants looking for a better economic situation. Uh, and then I got involved in music now. Ah, so you started music here in New York? Yeah. I oh. used to play when I was in Colorado. I, I learned it about this. I learned more about this here. Yeah. Where did you get the flute? Did you buy it here in New York? No, no, you need to get it in Colombia from the people. From there, like, they don't say, I don't think you can get it here. No. And I mean, there's nobody making them. You have to go to Colombia and get the, get the, what, you know, the materials right. at least to, to make them here. Uh, it's bamboo, right? No, it's, it's not? cactus. A cactus. Dry cactus. Oh. Yeah. And the uh, percussion thing, what do you call it's this? Maracon. Maracon. Maracone has achuiras, yes. so seeds inside. And it's a calabazo, so it's mm -hmm. a, like a, some kind of cousin of the pumpkin. Ah, the, okay. You know, one of those squashes. Right. Yeah. Well, let's, um, yeah. listening to your music, it was really uh, uh, like trance like meditation, mm. uh, calm and peaceful. Is it so? Is what? What's this? What was this song about? This song? Uh, I really don't know. You don't know? I don't know what this song is about. So how do you feel when you played it? Uh, well, this is what supposed is to be a gaita. This music is supposed to be for dancing. Ah, for supposed dancing. To, yeah. They're missing the drums. But right. It's, it's a gaita rhythm. Mm -hmm. It's like it's like similar to cumbia. Mm, cumbia. It's like cumbia. It's called, cumbia okay. Cumbia comes from this. Ah, okay. Cumbia, cumbia is like, comes from this kind of music. Yeah, from that format. Three drums, two guys. So music Bring music. cumbia. It's not music. It's Good. Music. And uh, so, uh, when do you, will you have a concert somewhere, sometime? Well, we play... So the thing is this. <laughs> okay, <laughs> tell me. <laughs> so we have a band called Maku Sound System, okay? And that band, we've been playing with that band for the past since, you know, Camilo founded it. Then we've been playing for a while now and we've been
been doing our way of expressing ourselves musically. You know, this is we do folkloric stuff. You know, whenever we can at the park or um, at, you know, there are many Colombian musicians here who are who also do it. You know, yes. I learned from this guy whose name is Martin Bejarano. He was the one that taught me how to play the. So introduced me here. You know what I mean. And then there's a world right. in Colombia with many of the maestros that Camilo talks about, like this is Maria Sallas, Paito, Sixto Sigal, mm -hmm. Paito, Caetano mm -hmm. uh, de San Jacinto. Right. There's a whole. You know, this has huge history to it, as you can see. So with. We, so we we don't have any concerts, but we are actually you know if we could play every day, we would do it. Okay. Uh, if we could sustain ourselves from it, we would definitely do it. Uh, and I think we're trying to look for something like camaradas, but that has a, nothing. We don't have anything yet. Basically. We're trying to. So okay. Maybe your your okay. on the yes on the on, on your media. Okay. Um, so uh, what I just need is maybe a website or a link or yeah, yeah, mail yeah. address. Email address. Oh, People website, could like an email address. An email address. Yeah, email address. And then the, our band is a different band. It's called Maku Sound System. It's just that's it's a larger thing. It's horns, it's oh. electric bass, electric guitar, drums, the percussion, the rhythm. Does it have a website? Of, of it. Yeah. Well, that there is a website for that. Yeah. Oh, Maku's, good. Okay. M a k u Sound System. Mm -hmm. Dot com. Okay. So all of that is there. So we 